Ashley Pelton. I'm from Loma Linda University and I am the instructional technologist for the university. Um, best day of my life was actually Sunday. It was the World Series in LA, uh, Red Sox versus the Dodgers. My brother is actually the backup shortstop for the Boston Red Sox, so I got to see him win a world championship, which was just astounding. It was a surreal, surreal day from start to finish because I got to see the culmination of a lifetime of work for him. And what did it look like and what did it feel like? It felt like this idea that I'm not supposed to be here. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve to experience this because I haven't put any of the work in. But just absolute gratitude that I was involved, that I got to be on the field afterwards, that I got to uh, be one of the first people to hug him after, after that day because, again, I was the only person in our family that got to go. Um, and just exceptional gratitude for this once in a lifetime experience that I got to be a part of. Hi, my name is Andrea Saylor, and I currently live in Loma Linda, and I, I work at Loma Linda University. Um, on my best day, what I believe in is I believe in a space where um, the light of others shine. So what that looks like for me is um, I get the opportunity to work with K-12 students um, bridging uh, Loma Linda University, making connections there, and it's just so awesome when I get to see um, teachers seeing their schools in a different perspective and seeing their students um, in a different light where they're able to tailor their learning and curriculum towards them and then having them actualize that in their classroom and build a closer knit, uh, greater community within that. And so for me, I think that's such a special space and a wonderful opportunity and I hope others get to do the same. Hey, my name is Mike. Uh, I'm from New York Institute of Technology. I work as the uh, Director of Business Intelligence and Analytics, and what's it like to be me? I, uh, I'm a first-generation college student, but am I really? Uh, I deal with first-generation college students all the time, but I think of myself uh, sometimes maybe as an insider, but sometimes as an outsider, because what I really did was I was born in the Philippines, I'm Asian-American, uh, born in the Philippines that is a Catholic, uh, English-speaking country, and I came to a Catholic to a Christian English-speaking country. So although I look first generation, am I really? And so when I deal with students and I talk to them all the time, you know, am I really relating to the experience they have? And that sometimes feels like I feel like an imposter, but sometimes I also feel like an ally and I hope to bridge the gap and hope to make a difference in their lives. That's what it feels like to be me.